Hindu Kush Himalayan region is a source of Asia's 10 major river systems. It provides water, ecosystem services and livelihoods to more than 210 million people. It is also a source of water for more than 1.3 billion people living in downstream river basins. However, in recent years, the ecosystems and communities in the region and the downstream terrain have begun to experience the adverse effects of climate change. The International Center for Integrated Mountain Development, ISIMOD, is working towards addressing these changes by applying different techniques and methods. ISIMOD serves the Hindu Kush Himalayan region. Basically, that's the mountain regions in eight different countries. The Hindu Kush are in Afghanistan, stretching over to the Karakoram, uh, into the Himalayan arc and the Tibetan plateau. So our region is, yes, Nepal, but Bhutan, India, China, uh, Afghanistan, Pakistan, Myanmar, as well as Bangladesh. So the mountain regions in those HKH countries. And uh, we have been uh, working uh, with severe Himalaya to address some of the major issues that are facing mountain environments, mountain people in this region. Surveyor a joint initiative of USAID, United States Agency for International Development, and NASA, National Aeronautics and Space Administration, is a regional visualization and monitoring system that integrates Earth observations such as satellite imagery and forecast models for timely decision making. Server Himalay is implemented in partnership with EC Mode and aims to develop relevant geospatial applications and increase access to data and decision support tools on different thematic areas in the region. ECMOD has given due recognition to modern technology. For instance, uh, geographical information system, remote sensing, and established a program called MENRIS program, Mountain Environment and Natural Resources Information System program. Mountains are often inaccessible, challenged by very difficult terrain. But at the same time, GIS and remote sensing technology uh, with the satellite uh, data and information uh, provide a useful means to gather uh, data from remote mountain locations. And one of the longest serving program at ECMOD has used this uh, technology in many in different um, areas uh, to support our member governments, to support uh, national partner agencies uh, in the Hindu Kusimalan region. Policymakers and experts have identified geographic information and earth observation as a handy tool for making informed decisions related to climate change. The basic idea of Survey Himalaya is to collect space from villages in terms of bringing all those space based information and developing the applications derived from this uh, satellite-based information into uh, those information which are useful for decision-making. On top of that, they use uh, geospatial analytical tools. The Survey Himalaya has been initiated to understand and quantify the availability, change and condition of the major resources like grasslands, forests, water, and agriculture. This uh, drought early warning system primarily based on the precipitation forecast, which can also be used for uh, flood forecast. At this point of time, this is May season. As we know, this uh, season is much drier than before. We see the current is uh, yellow or poorer than average conditions. At this particular stage, we are already looking at the agriculture drought, where we'll try to develop an early warning system. These warnings we can also take forward to farmer level, so they can take appropriate measures.
this kind of information like brown or those dark brown will indicate the districts with high frequency of flood events and lighter yellows will give you the districts with less disaster events. Government under the leadership of Ministry of Home Affairs, they have developed a DRR portal. After having looked at our system, they thought this is very good and informative and helps in disaster preparedness for the country. Here uh, we have used the Landsat 1990 image and analyzed the land cover statistics in Nepal. If we see the comparison between 1990 and 2010, agriculture uh, is likely increasing. That shows population growth and its demand on the uh, food part. Government may take this kind of product at the policy level, at the uh, local level. They can also use these products as how much forest cover is existing in their area and how much agriculture is there. Actually what happens is uh, Modi's NASA's Terra and Aqua satellites which are equipped with Modi's uh, sensors. So it detects the fire on the ground. People can view the cumulative fire incidents as well for any given time period. And once we do that then we send out uh, the SMS alert as well as email alerts to relevant subscribers. This is the kind of SMS that people get. Forest is playing a very major role in the climate change. If you just see, there was no forest in 1990 in this particular patch. Here, the forest is there. We are putting all the information into the system. This is called the red information system. The community is very happy by saving this forest. They are going to get the benefit in terms of the money. So in these watershed, they have taken the seed money to save their forest area. The mountain geoportal is a gateway to geo-information resources of the Hindu Kush Himalayan region and aims to facilitate the sharing, integration and use of geographic information across a broad use base. It provides access to science applications and data sets. It also disseminates information on various issues through interactive story maps. Training and capacity building is an integral part of Servir Himalay program. The program continues to host and organize youth activities in collaboration with national partners such as youth forums, NASA developed programs, NASA Space Challenge Hackathon and internship programs that bring together like-minded youths to exchange ideas. So unfortunately our satellites do not map these areas with their sensors about uh, people having uh, real-life problems. For people living in the region facing adverse impacts of climate change, it is necessary to have an improved understanding of climate change issues and ways of adapting to the ever-changing environment. Servir Himale is providing Earth observation data, which is proving critical for decision-makers in understanding the causes and effects of climate change.